Hi, I'm Jamie, an engineer here at Retool and one of the makers of the API generator. I'm super excited to share this tool with you all today for building custom data sets and uh, read-write APIs on top of them for your prototyping, testing, demo use cases. Um, so I'm gonna run you through the tool really quickly. Um, first, here's where we build the data set. Uh, so, so far I've got name, I've got a rating, but I can use any of the 100 plus data types that we've created here for you all. Um, so here's company, and maybe I also wanna get something Maybe a little more niche, like maybe something like logos. Cool, so I've added logos. And now I'm gonna go ahead and name this and I'll generate the API. Great, cool. So now you can see all the sort of read-write endpoints you'd expect. I'm gonna grab this get endpoint here and paste that in. Cool, so now you should be able to see all the different types of data that I expect. Um, now maybe I wanna like write back, grab this post endpoint. Cool, so here, I've got an ID, got a new one, and then uh, maybe I'll also grab my name, and I'll add myself to this data set. Cool, awesome, so now I've added myself. Uh, maybe I just wanna check that that persists by grabbing this filter. Cool, now you can see those data's here, and you can use this both for sort of read and write use cases. So lastly, I just wanna show you kind of one of the use cases I built on top of this. Uh, this is a quick sort of re, uh, CRUD application for refunding. Um, uh, right over here, it sort of reads in data from the API for um, uh, for all this different uh, rental data. And then you can write back to it uh, and approve or deny a refund um, like this, and that persists in the API. Uh, super excited to see what you all will build with this. Um, please feel free to ask any questions below. Thanks so much.